Hey guys, we're back with another walkthrough for Super Duper Mario. Okay, here we go. Alright, in this part we're going to show you the answer to the door that you cannot open. What the heck did I just do? See, you cannot open this door when you go up to it. It says, a door. It looks as, a, as though it's held closed by some mysterious force. And that it is. So, oh my god, that hand is... That hand's coming up here. Okay, that's odd. So you're gonna point towards the door, and you're gonna click the A button, and then Tippy's gonna say this door. It's no ordinary door. Then, halt! What's this then? Travelers have come? Ah, the door has a face! Now, Queen Jade's demands a guard. I guard this door. People, I'm Door Guy the First. Lots of monsters around, folks. Lots of monsters. So I've got to do the, do routine checks, okay? Sorry for the trouble, folks, but I need to make sure you're trustworthy. Just a couple of questions. Answer them all correctly and we're done here. Then you can head on through. Here's the first one. All right. Here we go. I'm warning you, though. These are pretty tough questions, so use those not me. All right, now he's just gonna say this to blow you off track. You're gonna be like thinking all these things and writing it down, just skip it. Trust me, just skip it. All right, who is the most powerful person in the underwear? Now, he was talking about D-Man A goes to a shop and buys this, D-Man B goes to the shop and buys this, but then the question is this. So the ruler or the most powerful person in the underwear is not Queen DJ's, not Queen Dave's, Dave's, it's Jade's, if you remember. Dingo, correct. Next question. Shade B, okay, he's just gonna say this to blow you off track again. Those are the facts. Now, what is my name? Now you could say Gore Guy the, Fir the Thirst. And, as we all know, gore means blood, and he does not look like a blood monster or anything. You could say boar guy the fur, the 64th, I keep on saying first, the 64th, because he is pretty boring, <laughs> but he is definitely not the 64th door I've seen in this game. Maybe he is, I don't know. Door guy the first. Definitely this is his name because this is the first talking door we've seen in the game, and he is a door. And he's part guy. Dingo! Correct. Now for the last question. Okay. Now you want to actually read how many times he says the word apple. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. He said it six times. How many times did I just say the word apple? And you're gonna, it's not five, it's not seven, it was six, if you remember. Dingo, correct. You folks seem okay to me, head on through. All right, so really the only question you really need to pay attention to is the last one. You have to figure out how many times he, what was that rumbling noise? You have to figure out how many times he says apple. It sounds like it's coming through this door. Huh, what do you want? Look, we love to chit chat, but we're crunch time busy over here. Can you tell? Can you tell? We simply must reach over there. But we don't know which way it is. Over there, huh? See that door on your left? It'll lead you up there, but we can't open right now. We gotta guard this door. We trapped the raging beast from underwear inside. Yep, this thing here is definitely the one that escaped its prison. Can't have it breaching security, so we lock both doors just in case. Things beast, let me tell you, real nasty. If it starts rampaging again, I don't want to be the D-man who has to stop it. Problem is, until someone subdues it, we can't use the door to over there. So if you could tame it, we can open that door for you. Want to give it a shot? Yeah. But <laughs> I was just messing with you. Seriously, no one would ever be dumb enough to... Wait, did you just say yes? Are you nuts? You're, you're serious. You actually think you can tame that beast? 
Well, hey, yeah, great idea. Sounds like a smart plan. Then tell you what, you add on in and I'll mail your mustache to your next of kin. Look, my prediction, your game is about to end. If not, we'll help you on your way. Give it a shot, champ. Alright, well, they're so encouraging, aren't they? They're just so nice saying that I'll die. They are the nicest people in the world. Okay. Ooh. What the? <gasps> Where have we heard that noise before? It's... Whoa, how did the torches just light themselves? Bowser! <gasps> Where am I? And why do these drinks and chains keep jumping me? And what's with the dark? And Peach is in here, and I'm hungry. What do I do to deserve this? Hey, it's the guy in green. You're alive? But where's everyone else? What happened to Peach? We don't know yet. We're looking for her, too. So what you're telling me is that... What you're telling me is that she is... She's definitely not here. I don't like this one bit. Aha, I see a little plan. You wanna break up on me and Peach? I'm going. What? Yeah, you've been waiting for a chance to fire them all to be back in the back. No? Uh, no, we truly don't know where Peach is. We merely... Can it, you ugly little ball. It'll stomp the truth out of you. Charge! What the... You can't charge, buddy. Can I jump on you with Gary? No, that would be a no. Wait, let me try again. Haha, <laughs> I can! I'm so happy. I wouldn't have to jump on you if he would... Wait, what was he about to do? Ow. Whoa, he's like, mad. Anger! Bowser's got anger management problems. I jumped on you like 12 times. Hey! How come you're still alive? I jumped on you like 10 times already. For the love of crap, die. That's 12, that's 13. Are you gonna die yet? Yes, he died. Okay. Rah! Dang, why do I always lose? What is wrong with me? I get up every time, though, and as many times it takes to send you to the underwear. Um, sorry to break this to you, big guy, but we're already there. See, this is the underwear. What? What are you talking about? I look like a guy whose game is over. Well, you look like a guy who's drunk. By the way, you're standing. You and Mario were sent here to the land of ended games to the underwear. We didn't know what happened to any of you. Not just Peach. What? So wait, Peach really is lost out there somewhere? Why didn't you say so, idiot? You could have been searching this whole entire time. Bowser has rejoined the party. What are you waiting for? Let's move. Hey, it's you, and your game isn't over. Did you run away or something? What? You beat it? Seriously? No way! Man, I can't believe it. Wow, uh, thanks. You're a prime go-getter, pal. This key will open the door that connects to the over there. You got a door key! Yay. Cool, cool, problem solved. Way to go, thing outside the box there, people. I'll just stay on watch here. You two will go find the rest of the monsters out there. We're on it! Oh, hey, and let me give you a little tip. Lots of dark areas around you, right? Solution, put a little flame to the torch sonnets you see on the wall. They'll light up the place for a while. Look careful, though. They'll eventually go out. If you know someone who can use fire, get them on the torch duty stack. Oh, and here's a save block. So before we go through the door, we can just save it, and yeah, I'm gonna save it. All right, well, let's aim for this walkthrough. In the next one, we'll go through the door and see what lies ahead of it. See you then, bye.